our viewers welcome to may june 2020 wayek also known as wasi past questions and detailed solution general mathematics mathematics core paper 2 part 2 this part contains questions 6 to 13 about eight questions and you are expected to answer five questions in this part solution to eight questions in one video question 6a copy and complete the table of values for the relation y equal to 3 sine 2 s you have the table of values with some values missing for y and you are expected to solve for them b using a scale of 2 cm to 15 degrees on the s axis and 2 cm to 1 unit on the y axis draw the graph of y equal to 3 sine 2 s for 0 degrees less than or equal to s less than or equal to 150 degrees see part of the question use the graph to find the truth set of one three sine two s plus two equal to zero one two three over two sine two s equal to zero point two five solution part a is to complete the table of values to get y this is just what is needed so i'm going to take one trial and show you how to go about it when s is 120 degrees y is equal to 3 sine 2 s so you have to multiply s 120 by 2 and that is what you have here if you multiply you have 3 sine 240 degrees so you have to check sine 240 degrees first and that is minus 0 0.8660 before you use the coefficient of 3 to multiply it and that gives minus 2.5 980 and to one decimal place you have minus one sorry minus 2.6 to one decimal place minus 2.6 that is the value of y when s is 120 degrees so you do the same thing for others you can use your calculator directly you can enter this value in your calculator directly and you get the answer b part we are to plot the graph let's start with the given scale 2 cm to 15 degrees on the s axis 2 cm to 1 unit on the y axis this graph that i'm using you can see that each boss has five lines so that five lines implies one c n the meaning is that you have to combine two bosses to have two c m and you give it one by the given scale the next two bosses becomes two the next two bosses becomes three and so on if you go down you have minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 on the s axis same thing two buses is 15 degrees the next two becomes 30 degrees the next two is 45 you have 60 75 
90, 105, 120, 135, 150 or in degrees. This K simply implies that one line is 0 0.1 units on y axis and 1.5 degrees on s axis 0 0.1 units on y axis 1.5 degrees on s axis to get that 0 0.1 is very simple the 2 cm you have here is 10 lines the 10 lines is 1 unit so divide 1 by 10 it gives 0 0.1 then on the x axis you divide 15 by 10 and you have 1.5 next thing is to plot the coordinates when s is 0 y is 0 you plot that at the origin this is the origin when s is 15 degrees y is 1.5 after 1 you count 5 lines up and you have 1.5 somewhere here against 15 degrees when s is 30 degrees y is 2.6 after 2 you can't six lines up you have it here when s is 45 degrees y is 3.0 that one is very easy to trace when s is 60 degrees y is 2.6 somewhere here when s is 75 degrees y is 1.5 when s is 90 degrees y is 0 you plot that point directly on the y axis sorry on the s axis you plot it directly on the s axis when s is 105 degrees y is minus 1.5 so the graph is going down now when s is 120 degrees y is minus 2.6 after 2 after minus 2 you count 6 lines down and you have minus 2.6 when s is 135 degrees y is minus 3 and when s is 150 degrees y is minus 2.6 so we take because of 2 cm now we take the edge here as 150 and you have minus 2.6 all the points have been plotted next thing is to join them together and use the graph to answer c part of the question all the points have been joined together so let's move to C part use the graph to find the truth set of Roman figure 1 3 sine 2 s plus 2 equal to 0 you can only use the graph to solve this equation if and only if it can be adjusted to the one that is plotted for you to achieve this you simply transfer plus 2 to the right hand side and you have 3 sine 2s equal to minus 2 and what you have here is equal to y it simply means that the solution to the equation occurs at y equal to minus 2 you go to the y axis and you locate minus 2 then you trace it to meet the curve at this point and you trace to s axis remember that on the s axis one line is minus
my one line is 1.5 degrees 1.5 so after 150 you have about four lines so after 105 after 105 you have about four lines so those four lines means 1.5 times 4 1.5 times 4 that should give you about 6 so if you add the 6 to 105 degrees you have 111 degrees from if you got 2 you should find the true set of 3 over 2 sine 2s equal to 0 0.25 to get the graph that is plotted or the the equation you have to multiply through by 2 to remove this 2 that is clear fraction and you have 3 sine 2s is equal to 2 times 0 0.25 and that is 3 sine 2s equal to 0 0.5 this means that the solution to the equation occurs at y equal to 0 0.5 you move to the y axis we have stated that one line is 0, point, 0 0.1 so if you count five lines somewhere here is 0 0.5 so you trace to meet the curve at all possible points one point is here another point is here if you trace the first point to the s axis noting that one line is 1.5 degrees you have 4.5 degrees and for the second point if you count from 75 degrees to where the line falls in you have 87 degrees so the true set of that equation is s equal to 4.5 degrees and 87 degrees